Hey, welcome back to Cool Kids Art, and let's draw the very funny looking triggerfish skin in Fortnite. So let's get started with a quick sketch, and then I will show you line by line on how you can draw this. Alright, so let's draw this skin, and to begin, we're going to start out right on the top of his head. So we're going to draw one big curve. Okay, and then on the side here is going to be his eye. So from here on the corner, just curve in and come back out. So same thing here, just curve in and come back out past this point. And then from there we can draw in his eye. So right here from these two points here, I'm just gonna draw one smooth curve. So this is almost like a half circle. Okay, and then to finish off the face, so right in the corner here, I'm just going to come down and then I'm going to round off the bottom here. So this is going to be the bottom of his head and also the, uh, I guess the top of that bandana that he's wearing around his neck. Alright, and let's just go ahead and finish up that part, this little wrap around his neck. So right here, just a little bracket first. And then just come down and just round everything off. Okay, so let's go back up here and finish up the uh, the head. So right here, I'm just going to draw one line across. It's going to be the bandana. And then for his eyes, so just somewhere in the middle here, I'm going to draw two curves, one going up, one going down. And then for his eyeball, I'm just going to put him right here. Okay, and then for this one, um, let's give him a little bit of a meaner look here. So I'm going to start right in the middle. I'm going to slant up. And then this one is going to slant. Well, actually, it's almost horizontal, but it looks like it's coming down. Okay, and then for finishing up the eye right here, draw one curve. And then now let me shade it in. And before I do that, I'm just going to draw a circle inside. So this is going to be my highlight. And then I'll just shade around it. Okay, so let's go ahead and finish up his mouth, which is always very funny looking. So let's just go ahead and draw in one line first. Just come down, draw one line across, and then we'll draw a curve right around it. So on the corners here, it's the easier way to draw this is just to draw a bracket like this first. And then we'll just round off the top and bottom. Alright, so that's the head and let's add in some detail to the wrap so that we can kind of make it look more like cloth. So I'm going to come right here on this curve on the bottom. Just kind of extend it all the way around. And I'm going to start right here. Just come toward the middle. And then just one more. Shorter one. Alright, so let's leave it like that and let's work on his body. So right here on the side. Just going to come down first. So this is going to be his armpit right here. And then we're going to taper it in. Pinch it down all the way down to his waist. Come across. That's going to be the top of the belt. So we'll just add in one section. Just turn that into one big rectangle. And let's just go ahead and add in two lines here for the belt buckle. Alright, so there's going to be details in here. But let's just go ahead and uh, rough out the arms first. So right here, armpit. Come back up here. Curve. And his sleeves kind of rolled up here, so I'm just going to slant up. And then from this line, let's draw like a little rectangle. Let's make it a little bit rounded. Okay, so here's the armpit. Come down. Close it off. And again, just round it off. Okay, and then for his arm, it's really easy because it's just pretty much like a spaghetti arm. 
So I'm gonna start here. Just curve down and then come back up here. And his arms are really skinny. Okay, so that's gonna be his wrist. And then for his fist, curve down. Here's the back of the fist. Just come down and just curve it around and just hook it back up to the thumb. Okay, so same thing here. Curve, just use the other side for reference. So nice and skinny here. So same thing here for the thumb. One little hook. Back of the fist, just come down, curve it, hook it to the thumb. And then let's add one line here. It's got those uh, textures on his skin. So I'm just gonna draw one line pretty much in the middle. Okay, and then we can add in a couple lines here just to make it look like cloth. All right, so now let's add in those details right here. He's wearing some kind of, uh, some kind of army vest. So right in the middle, let's draw one line first. And then from the armpit area, just go up. Just gonna draw two little slants into the head. So that's gonna be a strap back here. And then on this side right here, it's got one big pocket. And then the flap, I'm just gonna curve down. And let's add a little button there. Okay, and then it's got a bunch of shells here. I'm just gonna draw two. So I'm just gonna draw like a little square first. One line across. And then for the tip here, another line and then two more lines in the center. I know there's a lot of little lines here, but once I color this, we'll be able to see it a little bit more clearly. Okay, so that's the upper body. And his legs really easy. Um, his pants a little bit lower here. So just right in the middle, make a little point. Just draw one big curve like this first. And then on the side here, angle, angle, right around here. Got those two little bumps. So stop right around here. And then now we can finish up his legs. So his legs, um, there's not a lot of detail, it's pretty smooth. So I'm gonna start on the outside. One big curve coming down. And I'm gonna start up here. Just curve all the way down. I'm gonna close it off with a little curve. Okay, and then let's just go ahead and finish this part up. So for his shoe, just a dome shape. Come down. Let's come down a little bit more on this side. Close it off and let's add one line here. Okay, so pretty much the same on the other side. Start here, just one big curve coming down. Start back up here. Come down and close it off with a little curve going up. Same thing here for the shoe, just come down. Come on a little bit more. Close it off in one extra line. Okay, and then on the bottom here for his boot, we'll just draw two lines like this. And let's add a little bit more detail here, just on the side. Let's draw two lines. Okay, and then let's see, he's got those pouches on the side. So right from the belt here, just go out and just hook it back in. So same thing here, just go out, just come back in. And then for the flap, just kind of follow that angle, go out. Okay, and then lastly, uh, let's add in some circles here. He's got those textures on his uh, pants here. Alright, so that is it for this very funny looking trigger fish. Hope you guys liked the way it turned out, and if you do, please do give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you next time.